Travis Wayne Goodsell. I should probably give uh, my regular viewers an update. As you've noticed, I've, for the last couple of days, been focused on variations of Joseph Smith's sermon, 19 July 1840, after talking about uh, the threats to my life because of the LDS Church. <clears throat> I've got to keep the video short because the YouTube employee has become an accessory after the fact of first degree murder and other serious felony crimes which if you saw that video yesterday uh, is a pretty serious crime that the Mormon YouTube employee is causing it must be understood my crime my evil was going to the church church headquarters January 1st 1998 and presenting them with my paleo Hebrew decipherment of the script and ever since then the church has declared me their enemy and I've since learned why because I've gone on to expose why in my YouTube channels Travis Wayne Goodsell the Mormon YouTube employee shut it down to cover up and defend the church <coughs> and, and so I've literally been tortured all this time they don't go out with guns and knives making their threats. They do it by withholding things from people. Positions, money, services, goods. They torture people. When I tried suing the church in August 2008, you know, the First Amendment right. The state of Utah, under orders of the church, being loyal to the church as Mormons themselves, and thus were rewarded, or at least the one who wasn't Mormon was rewarded, for turning around and instead locking me up in Utah's Nazi concentration camp not prison nope I never went to trial never had the hearings necessary a former missionary companion Mark Augustine sent me up the river he wanted revenge I guess for having him run our area as he wanted it to be run and he chose instead to whine and complain to the mission president all the time So he wanted revenge, I guess. He wanted me to control him. <laughs> but anyway, I miraculously was freed in 2014. The right before the pre-show event of the latter days. My education is all about the ancient cultures anthropology of the ancient Middle East. <clears throat> it's a hard science, not pseudo-fake science like psychology. And I, I knew at that time in 2017 that, that, that it was here with the announcement of the solar eclipse on the 21st of August 2017. I've got to wrap this up, I see. And uh, if you saw the video where I talk about the parable of the salesman who comes to your neighborhood demanding to enter into your home and have you pay him money to sell you things, 
and then turns on uh, get turn has the your neighbors lied to about you so that they try to turn on you yeah well that's what this person has done it's called an associate in the, in the crime structure crime organization structure <clears throat> and uh, he's the one that has been uh, threatening on me on YouTube and uh, has been involved and instrumental in destroying me financially and uh, he was included in the lawsuits against the church that I filed in 2020 and 2021 or well it was 2019 and then 2020 at the end that's when they were denied because the government is controlled by Mormons who are loyal to the church. Judges are all supposed to recuse themselves. And so, yeah, I know the guy who is instrumental in doing the church's orders. And he got handsomely rewarded, just like that other person who sent me to the Utah Nazi concentration camp. I have the evidence. I have the money trail. Same thing with this guy. And I keep talking about the doctrinal principle uh, explaining further about the beam and moat. That which you falsely accuse in another reveals the same and worse fault in yourself. And so, yeah, I was able to recognize from his uh, YouTube death threat comments and abusive, verbally abusive comments that, uh, yeah, yep, that continues to hold true as a precept. Because uh, my physical appearance, my living conditions, was all from the church. I didn't ask to be this. This is a, a punishment by the church for being a translator. And then going on to expose the church for paying and profiting off of the war in Ukraine so that they can overthrow the world governments. Isn't that great? Just remember, I did that. You all are witnesses on my channels. You saw when I first brought it up. You saw when I told you, hey, church just sent me a death threat to destroy me. And there were people who didn't believe, but here we are. I've informed the government, but apparently they're not going to do anything. All different kinds of government agencies at all levels which means that they are compromised to the church as well and as compromised to the church wow do you fully grasp the full ramifications of what that means that our United States government is accessories after the fact of the church's crimes that's just horrifying and means that they've already handed over the government of the United States to the church what we see on the news is just a show whether the Congress people know this or not that's another issue so yeah I've also uh, notified this salesperson's bosses as uh, I need to find out if they too are going to be complicit or if they will throw him under the bus after having promoted and paid for what he has done to me I already know they are guilty and so now I'm just needing to find out if they will 
fix the mess he caused and remove him from society or if uh, they will become accessories after the fact as well. So that's the update.